Oh, hey, um, how's your dad? He's doing better. Um, next month we have one more surgery, and if everything goes well, we should be in the clear. That sounds great. I know it's been tough on you. If you need anything, you let me know, okay? All right, I will. Thank you. Nick Spears. Listen very carefully. I'm listening. I seek the truth, and I need your help. And eh, what sort of truth are we speaking of? In two days, there will be an attack in the city. Many people will die. Okay. Um, thanks for the heads up on that. If you ignore me, their blood will be on your hands. I want to meet. I will explain more in person. Who are you? And how do you know people are going to die? Because... I am going to kill them. Hello? Everything okay? You ever have one of those weeks when you're just not sure what's real and what isn't? I'm an editor. Of course I do. I get this call from this guy today. He says he's gonna kill a lot of people. Don't get sucked into someone's cry for attention, Nick. We report real news when it happens. We're not in the business of gossip. I know. There seems something different about this, though. Look. We hired you because you're a good reporter, Nick. Just stay focused and don't let this kind of crap get to you. You're right. Completely right. Just gonna let it go. Besides, it's only Monday. We got a whole week of crazy to go. You can't keep leaving me alone like this. I know. Believe me, there's nowhere else I want to be but here. Then quit your job. <laughs> yeah, sure. Okay, that's uh... I mean it. I'm serious. Quit your job. Go freelance. You're always talking about it, so just do it. Yes, not that simple. It could be, Kevin. You need a change. We need a change. I know we do. So let's make a decision. Right now. I'm doing fine in the office, and you can go freelance, and then we can work out what we've been talking about. Maybe we should get a dog first. <laughs> we don't need a dog. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> I'll finish the shoot tomorrow and I'll start making some calls. We'll figure this out. <laughs> we can make it work.
Jeez. Rough night? <sighs> yeah, kind of. Look, I need you to crank double time on both pieces this week. I'm really trying to make a push this month. I'm on it. Are you sure? I'll get them done. Good. Let me know if you need anything. Hello? Halton Park Bus Terminal. Nine o'clock. Look. Tell me what's going on or just quit calling me. We will talk tonight. Nine o'clock. Do not be late. Yes. You came this far. Stay. You said we were going to meet in person. This is close enough. I'm not doing this over the phone. It would be wise for you to listen to what I have to say. Now you know I am serious. Why did you call me? I need your help. But why me? I wish to expose an army. I began as an agent in Russia. I worked my way up, then was recruited by the United States. One year ago I left the agency. I left because I did not want to live a double life anymore. Not long after, I started to lose track of my days. Time would vanish. I can only remember certain things. I used to hear about experimental procedures the government was doing to perform on its enemies. They would split your mind in half. Two personalities, each unaware of each other. It started as disconnected thoughts, clips of information that seemed to invade my mind. Thoughts that were not my own, were not organic. Locations and times, people's faces. Chaos. As I began to put the clips together, I saw myself as a weapon. One that I don't know how to control. You mentioned an attack tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, I am going to kill as many people as I can. Where is this going to happen? There has to be a way to stop this. There is nothing you can do. This goes too deep. What do you want from me? Why involve me? By the time this goes to print, it's gonna to be too late anyway. I am not telling you this because I want you to stop me. You cannot stop me. I chose you because this goes deeper than you could even imagine. And someone needs to tell the story. Who are you? My name is Mikhail Borsukov. Tomorrow, the world will know that name. Hello? My name is Nick Spears. There's a man. He's going to commit an act of terrorism tomorrow morning. I really need to speak to the police right now. Please hold. Wait, wait, wait. This is Sergeant Miller. Yes, sir. My name is Nick Spears. There's a man that's going to commit a terrible act tomorrow. I don't know where, but his name is Mikhail. Yes, sir. But I, but I haven't shared anything with you. Yeah, sir, we have everything under control. We appreciate your call. No, but I haven't told you anything yet. You have a pleasant evening. I have information that you're going to need. Hello? Hello?
Sunday. Morning. Oh, did you stay here last night? Um, yeah. What time is it? It's almost nine. I was gonna go and... Nick, are you okay? Oh, well, where's the fire? You need to come with me right now. Nick, what are you doing? If it were any other reporter, I'd have you cleaning out your desk. Just trust me on this, please. Nick, something happened at Halton Park. Is this... Mikhail, I know about Blue Sunday. Nick, what are you doing? 